bring your game. This is B. I will be demonstrating five easy abdominal exercises that you can perform in the comfort of your own home in as little as 10 minutes without involving traditional sit-ups or crunches. If you want to look like this, ladies, or guys, if you want that lean six-pack look, it is as easy as five simple steps each day. The workout routine consists of rotating through five different abdominal exercises, resting for about 10 to 15 seconds between each exercise. The order does not particularly matter, but I found the following rotation to be most beneficial. First, we will start with the traditional leg raises. Intermediates and advanced, you want to perform these with ankle weights. These are 5 pound ankle weights, so a total of 10 pounds. You can use different uh, weighted uh, ankle weights to whatever your preference is. This will make the weight, the exercise a lot more challenging and actually increase your results a lot faster as well and strengthen your abs uh, more so than just using your legs. So, while laying on your back you, with your feet together, you will lift your legs, keeping them as straight as possible. Lifting to only about 60 degrees, contrary to what most trainers tell you to lift to about 90 degrees. Actually, if you lift to 90 degrees, you will actually feel that your abs will actually lose the contraction. And so you want to make sure your, legs stay, your abs are staying contracted throughout the whole exercise. You also don't want your feet to touch the ground. You want to keep them at least an inch or two off the ground when you lower your legs back down. You want to perform about 20 reps of these. The second exercise is the leg crosses. They are similar to the scissors. But since you are performing the leg raises, I, I felt that it was best to incorporate a different leg motion than the vertical movement. So with the leg crosses, your legs will be overlapping one another while moving them horizontally. Each overlap is counted as one rep. For advanced, you can count two overlaps as one rep. Again, a total of 20 reps. The next one is my favorite. It's the Superman sit-ups. Very challenging. This is an advanced lift, and most people probably have not performed this. You start with your legs in the air, bent. 90 degrees at the knee, you will extend your legs away from your torso and lift your back off the floor. You will then crunch by moving your torso and your knees toward each other simultaneously and then push your knees and torso away from each other while not allowing your back to touch the ground throughout the entire exercise. You will perform 20 reps. If you are advanced and have never tried this lift, you want to try this without the ankle weights because you want to make sure you have proper form throughout the whole exercise. For beginners, you probably want to do as many as you can. You will eventually be able to do more as you keep on continuing to do the exercise. The next one is the old Russian twist or the seated twist. These are great at targeting your obliques, your side areas, your love handles. They're easy to perform. You get into sit-up position. You don't want your knees... In a, but in, instead of in setup position, your knees are not going to be as close to your torso. So you want to get into kind of com in a comfortable position. You want your torso, you want your back to be as straight as possible throughout the whole lift. And all you're going to do is clasp your, your hands together, or uh, again, advanced or intermediates, you want to use a plate, a dumbbell, kettlebell, something of five to ten pounds of weight. And you're just going to twist from left to right, making sure your back is staying straight throughout the whole lift. If you want to increase the intensity of the workout, you can always raise your feet off the floor and lean back further, as well as increase the speed of which you twist from left to right. The fifth and final exercise is the planks. You're going to be in push-up position, but instead of resting on your hands or your palms, you're going to be resting on your left and right forearms. You're going to hold this position for 10 seconds, and then you're going to lift your left leg in the air and hold for 10 seconds and then switch and lift your right leg and hold for 10 seconds. If you want if you're much more advanced, you might want to try raising your left arm to your side and your right leg in the air so that you'll be balancing on your left leg and your right forearm. And then of course you can reverse that as well and hold these for 10 seconds alternatively. Once you have completed all five exercises, you will repeat the routine two more times for a total of three sets. And that is it. You are done. In two weeks' time, you will have well-defined apps pending you have done the routine every day for the 14 days. And you can change up the routine, make certain exercises more difficult. It's up to you. But trust me, you will see results. There are no secrets to well-defined apps, nor do you have to perform fancy exercises. And ladies, you will not get too muscular since you do not have as much testosterone as men so you will get that toned look you like. Remember to keep a healthy diet. That is key to getting great abs. When in doubt, keep your meals natural and basic. Post a comment about this workout, please. Keep it clean.